Hey guys, this is Sinister. It's been a while since I've seen a horror movie. May God have mercy on my nerves. Multiple suicide. Whoa. Shit. Was it suicide or a murder? Because someone sawed off that branch so that it would fall at a certain time so that they would get hung. Is it a murder? Ethan Hawk. What's the number one rule? Paint only goes in the bedroom. And where doesn't it go? Anywhere else in the house. Right. Okay. Now, come with me. Move some boxes. Is there a problem? No, sir. Just a friendly visit. I appreciate that, Ellison Oswald. I know who you are. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with that guy? Well, what can I do for you? Well, not much, I expect, unless I can convince you to load those boxes back on that truck and leave as soon as you're able. Fuck you. No, I don't think so. This reminds me of that dickhead in First Blood. You don't seem to care much for our profession. Not everybody in your profession gets it right. I've read your books, neither do you. Look. <laughs> oh, you got it right in Kentucky blood, I'll give you that. Fine piece of writing. But uh, cold in morning, you got it wrong. Bad theory, you have to kill or go free. You ruin people's lives. You sure don't want that circus that you bring with you. It's not his fault if you didn't do your policing properly. You don't know that. Okay, so he's a true crime writer, and one of the books changed the outcome of a case so this guy doesn't want the same to happen to his town okay and there's a girl that was murdered or missing murdered but she could be missing or missing she could be murdered we didn't move in a few houses down from a crime scene again did we <laughs> no yeah. just don't say anything if we did i don't want to know about it we did Promise? I promise. Okay. I thought it was a murder. <laughs> oh, shit. What the hell? Oh! What the hell is that doing in the Midwest? You have scorpions in the Midwest? Shit. Well, I guess, yeah. Why not? Cool. Family hanging out alone. Hey, the market's terrible. Once we're not paying two mortgages, we'll be fine. And once I sell my new book, we'll be on easy street. Your father writes about terrible, terrible things that I don't want you Why knowing you anything about. Like I shouldn't be writing That's about. That's not what I meant. That's I mean, the way you say it. Well, I'm gonna hear about her at school anyway. Kids all hate me again and tell me nonstop about what happened. Let's at least make sure your office stays locked. It's one thing to hear about it. It's another thing to see it. I don't want him walking in again. He's 12 years old. Kentucky blood was 10 years ago. Mm. Mm. And what if that was your 15 minutes? Yeah. Okay. If you miss out on these years with the kids, you won't get them back. We just need one True. Chance. It's all one more. Okay. I got a really good feeling about good. this. I really do. If this goes sour, like last time, I'll take Trevor and Ashley and go back home to my sisters. Damn. A kid? Damn, the creepiest movies always have creepy kids. Oh god. And there are four of them? Or just two? Two and then the parents? Wait a second. Did they move into that house? He told her. He, they didn't get the house. They didn't. They didn't get a house that's a few. That's close. That's a few houses from, whatever house he's researching. He got the house. Bro, are you kidding me? Yeah, cause that, <clears throat> that attic was familiar. Oh yeah, and the tree too. Yeah, I should have realized from the tree. Who was filming it? 
the murderer? Why wasn't it taken into evidence originally? So there are three kids and two parents. And the girl wasn't one of those four. <laughs> Daddy, I can't find the bathroom. Shit. Why are you creeping around like that? Have a night light. Why does it have to be completely dark? Oh shit. Damn. Oh they oh my god, they're burnt alive. Shit, I thought they were just past that. Well, I guess they woke up after they started burning. Shit. You came back and left the box. Why? Okay, so when the crime happened and everything was closed, the house was cleaned up. Then he went, the murderer went back and put the box in the attic. Weird. Ashley? Fuck, it's not Ashley this time. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? Shit! Why? Oh my god. No, not backward. Isn't that his kid? You're having a bad dream, okay? One of those night terrors. Oh. Just go back to sleep. I thought these were over. It's just the stress of the move. I found him in one of the, one of the moving boxes. I want to I wanna tell you something. Yeah, I want to tell you that this house is fucked up. Damn, so there were two in the car, three, four in the tree, two in the car, and four in the pool. Shit, how many people? Oh my god, that's horrible. But that's better than fucking burning to death, and that's the guy? Fucking hell. He looks like... Who does he look like? He looks like a wrestler. Like from the late... No, from the early 2000s. Looks like a wrestler. The white face and the black hair. Yeah. Shit. Oh yeah, you paused it too long. Fuck, are you kidding me? Is that lost forever? Hey, at school, Ellison, and he's already hearing the grisly details of your mystery. Uh, well, what did he do? Oh. Exactly what he drew. That your book is about a family that was hung? Yeah. Christ, Ellison! No, not the dog, please. Ugh. So he came to this town to research this this case, but he just happened to have uh, happened to find these videos in the in the house that he uh, was renting or whatever.
he's really lucky to have these videos. Like he came to this to this town to research this crime and then lucky break he finds these tapes in a box. The grisly murders of a local family found earlier this week. Police have released this photo of Christopher Miller, the missing 13-year-old son of William and Penny Miller. The Millers, along with their younger son, were found stabbed inside their home. Yeah, the older son killed the family and ran off. He's not missing. Oh, hell no. of steel I would not go up there of course the the door is gonna close and it's gonna yeah <laughs> my stomach did drop even though I knew it was coming oh there's so many ghosts in this house oh No, but seriously, like, four in the tree, two in the car, four in the pool, and then three in the beds. So that's 13 people so far. Family hanging out, pool party, barbecue. Dad and mama, so, so three people. So it's 14 people. Sleepy time. Yeah, 14 people. Shit. Okay, so the missing girl drew those things? Well, uh, officer, thank you very much. It's, uh, I will, uh, if there's anything else I can do for you. Actually, there is. I left my copy of Kentucky Blood down at the station. It would really mean a lot to me <laughs> if you signed a copy, of course. Well, I, you know, I could be, like, you know, your deputy so-and-so. You know, I mean, if you don't already have one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are a few things you could do for me, actually. Really? Yeah, this could be perfect. I need the street address of a crime. 1998 St. Louis, a family was stabbed there. I also need any details you can get me on another murder. 1979, a family was burned alive. What feels better, seeing justice done or seeing your, your book, Kentucky Blood, number one, on the New York Times bestseller list? Mm -hmm. The justice, no, without question. I'd rather cut my hands off than write a book for fame or money. Mm-mm. Is he gonna still have his hands by the end of the movie? Shit. So it's like a guide to where he is in each... Uh... Yep. 2976, like 2976. Yeah, why? Does that mean something to you? Uh, no, no, it doesn't. No, thank you. Thank you, Deputy. What? Before the Stevensons moved here, they lived where the Miller family murders happened. Holy shit. Oh my god, was he in there with him? Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh! What? Ashley? Shit. Trevor? Mr. Boogie is toying with him. Fuck. Every night it's gonna be something new.
shit. He's gonna see him outside. Boy. Oh my god. Mm. I don't think that's gonna help you, bro. Shit, it's gonna be his son and he's gonna fucking split his head open. not there. He's gonna find pictures on his phone. He's gonna find pictures on his phone. Oh. Oh. I don't want to hurt you. I just want to get my bat. So if you come at me, I can bash your head in. Okay? That's fine. You keep it. See, this is when I would leave. Toxicology reports in some cases the killer drugged his victims. Wait, with what? Mm -hmm. Well, they couldn't tell for sure. But by drugging them, the killer removes his need to overpower them. The only other significant link between the murder cases is that in each instance, the killer murdered the entire family except one. Oh. The child, which he took with him. That and this symbol appears in several of the crime scenes. There's a professor over there, Professor Jonas. He's an occult crime expert, and the state police bring him in on some of the, uh, the weirder stuff. I think this qualifies. He just walks in. He's gonna run over them with a, with a lawnmower. <laughs> Dad, I was joking! Shit. Professor Jonas? Yes. Hello. Hey, thank you for getting oh, back to me so quickly. I Kyle. appreciate that. The symbol uh, that you sent me is, is, isn't a pentagram. It's a symbol uh, associated with the worship of a pagan deity. Uh, the crimes that you're dealing with, they all have the element of a missing child, correct? Yes. Yeah. That's correct. Well, Bagul eats children. Each story involves a, a, a different way that he lures or tricks these children uh, away from the physical world and traps them in his own netherworld and he consumes their souls over time. <laughs> Shit. Again, this is where I would move. Isn't that his daughter? Isn't that his daughter? Because that missing girl was not blonde. The one in the picture. His daughter's a redhead. Oh my god. Oh my god. He can't see him? So just we can see him? Okay, no, those are not his kids. Shit, but he can't see them. Oh my god. Shit. So those are the four missing kids? from the different crimes. What? Oh, fuck. Oh, my 
god! Oh my god! How is she not pissing her pants? She probably already did piss her pants. Oh my god. That is fucked up. Someone in the window, the shadow. Something's wrong. No, 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 no. No, that's too long. Stop it. It's too quiet. Is there something that you want to tell me? I speak parcel tongue. I don't believe in any, um, <laughs> you know, stuff. Stuff, you mean the supernatural, the metaphysical, the paranormal, that type of stuff? Right. <laughs> right. Of course you don't. You never would have moved into a crime scene if you did, but here we are. Seriously. Having this conversation. Why would you do that? We only gave you one rule. It was a big deal for us to let you paint in your walls. And what was it? What's the rule, Ashley? Paint only goes in the bed. But she didn't want it in my room because that used to be her brother's room. What? Mm. Who are you talking about? Stephanie. She used to live here. She's the one Daddy's writing his book about. So they're friendly with each other? I thought she was scared of her. I asked you if you were living in the house and you said no. asked me if we were living two houses down. Oh. Don't be a dickhead. What Trevor drew last week, that happened here. Mm-hmm. Yes. I guess we Like, at least tell her all the information before you make him fucking move. What's that? Their son? They put the video thing, the projector, in the attic. They took it to the attic. Fucking hell, five kids. Is one of them his? Shit. Fucking hell. Shit. <laughs> Fucking hell. What now? I feel about that. That's evidence. But did he have them all digitized? I think he probably had them all digitized. Okay, yeah, you don't need to have these. But you should have just put them in a storage unit off the property. What? Who is that? Yeah, you do. Where are we going, Daddy? We're going home, honey. Home, home, like you promised? Yeah, home, like I promised. Damn. Evening, Oswald. Why is the sheriff? fucking dickhead sheriff doing the night shift? Registration. That doesn't happen. Hey, you weren't bullied away or anything, were you? I'm sorry. What, what do I you care? Is, I don't want to be reading in your book that angry town folks chased you out of here. Don't tell me they follow them back to their old house. Come on. Hey, Al. Ten bucks said throw the sweep through the night. Early Christians believe that Bagula actually lived in the images themselves and that they were gateways into his realm. Gateways? Yes. The ancient church believed that he would take possession of those who saw the images and cause them to do terrible things. Children exposed to the images were especially vulnerable to Bugul's possession Shit. and or abduction.
They followed me. <clears throat> oh my god. <sighs> Shit, man. What's that? Oh, hell no. Shit. Oh my god. Like he just told you, people who see the images. You know what time it is? Yeah, I know, I'm sorry, but I've been trying to call you all day. Each family that you had me look up had previously lived in the house where one of the earlier murders took place. Oh my god, Each they're family. next. All five of them. Yes. Shit. And when you put them in chronological order, you can actually draw a line from murder to murder to murder. You just moved out of the last house in line. If, if this guy is still out there, you not only just sped up his timeline, you put yourself Fuck. in Fuck! It. It's not some guy. It's not some serial killer. It's a... Some paranormal shit that makes one person from each family do that stuff. Yeah, the paranormal thing makes the missing kid do the, the spirit. Yeah, the kid, yeah. All of them. Shit, man. So... It's either his daughter or his son that's gonna kill them all. Missing kids. Oh my god. Behind you, your son. Shit. Fuck. Come on, man. Is that his daughter? That's his daughter with the lawnmower? Or is that one of the girl, the one of the missing? Damn, his daughter looks like two of those missing girls. What is that? Good night, daddy. Oh my god. Oh, poison! She's gonna put well, sh well, she, yeah, she. I like that you made the movies longer. They're better this way. Okay, that's his daughter. Okay, deputy so and so, how about you uh, make a few calls, man? Deputy so and so, he's the one that's gonna save him. Come on. Oh my god. Don't worry, Daddy. I'll make you famous again. Shit. Really? She did it? Then there were six. What's with that creepy head tilt? Oh my god. And then she's taken into that realm place. That is creepy as fuck. And now there's a new reel. <sighs> you motherfucker. Of course they had to add some bullshit thing at the end. Well, 
it was a good uh, horror movie uh, I don't know it's an interesting uh, story it was a fun uh, horror movie L uh, nice uh, jump scares but it wasn't as scary as I thought it was gonna be people told me about this one so anyway I think I'm gonna watch two more horror movies I want to get proper horrified might as well